So Mr Crane, he is um, an English teacher. Uh, he's described as being very inspiring. He's been teaching for a while um, and he may be slightly disillusioned, um, slightly fed up with the fact he's, he's stunted with what he's trying to teach and he's trying to, he wants to enthuse. He's not, I suppose he's not trying to teach, he's trying to enthuse with the subject and he's just meeting blank walls. But with Alia, she's so keen to learn, she wants to learn and he recognises that. So I play Alia. She basically loves her teachers, loves education, really wants to get into Oxford. You'll have to find out if she does or not when you watch. The play then goes back and we see her throughout her school career and how she got where she is now. She is like the calm in all of the storm of the whole play. There's parents wanting to get their child into the best high school they can. Those conversations that you see in the play about, oh, I want my kid to go to this school. No, they have to go to that school. And there's also the think tank which is the education board, and they're trying to find an answer of how to fix our education system. So Alia is brought in to try and bring a new perspective onto their ideas, because they get so caught up in each of their own opinions. And it's quite funny, because they all act like the children in the play, when really there's a 16-year-old sitting there, and she's got all the answers. I don't know if there's a, a standalone singular message. It would probably be something like, um, education is complicated. <laughs>